Good morning, everybody. We have got an amazing start to the week on our Facebook Live. We are joined by Melissa from Cybex. Hello, hello, guys. Hello, Happy Monday. I know. <laughs> and what a great start to the week. Did you have an early start this morning? Uh, it was a relatively nice, easy drive. At least it hasn't rained, because I'm not going to lie, we've been fed up of rain, haven't we, the last Absolutely few weeks? Absolutely fed up. <laughs> I thought you were going to say, I'm glad it's not rained, because I'm in an open-top sports car. Oh, no, I wish. <laughs> uh, I mean, if my boss is listening, if we could provide those for the weekend, <laughs> I, I think that would be a great idea. Take you all out. We'll Absolutely. go to the beach. Absolutely. <laughs> I think that would be a great idea. So, hello everybody and happy Monday. If you're joining us this morning, do say hello because yes. we're, we're just feeling a little bit excited, aren't we? Yes. Yeah, say it, hello. Have your cup of tea. Yeah, sit with nice. your biscuits. Get ready to listen to all the info. Yeah. So, we're going to be looking at one of, I've said one of the new hero products wow. of Cybex today. Yes. And we've got an amazing prize because today we're giving one away. Not this oh. one. This one's mine, okay? We're not giving my <laughs> one away. But we have an amazing Cybex Gazelle oh. to give, S to give away, don't we? It's just gorgeous. And worth over £600. Yes. And for any of you mums that like a product that gives you every function and feature, we're going to run through it today, but it does just that. So if you've joined us, please do say hello so we feel like we're not on our own. So good morning, Anna Hardy King. You were the fastest fingers this morning. Oh, Not only wow. did she write hi, but she did a little wave. So I'm going to wave hey. back. Hi. <laughs> Haraya, good morning to you. And Holly Jane Hoffmeister and Keely Knight says she can't wait for today's live. Oh. Neither can we. I mean, it's my first live here at Pushchair Expert and I'm buzzing for it. Oh, I'm, I'm pleased, I'm pleased you didn't <laughs> run off down the road. Rachel Abraham, good morning to you. Beatrix as well. And Aoife, lots of people joining us this morning. It's an amazing prize. What do you think about the prize? Anybody who sat at home? Cora, um, Coral Valentine Newton says, what an amazing prize. Yes, it is an amazing prize. We're really lucky. Yeah. What a great start to the week. I mean, yeah, I was just like, girls from marketing, what can we help with push chair experts? Yeah, bam. bam! There we go. So... It is going to be great. We're going to run through it, give you the lowdown. And as I say, one lucky person will get one of And these. we're going to announce the winner right at the end. Now, to enter our prize draw this morning, all you need to do is just chat with Melissa and I. Oh, God, Any questions you you've got about Cybex, whether it's the Gazelle or any of the other Cybex um, products, do let us know because all your comments are entered into the draw. If you've hit share... We're going to love you forever. Do <laughs> tell us if you shared this morning because sharing is caring. Oh, I did. I shared you it. You shared? <laughs> yep. yep. So did I. So, Gazelle, oh, new where to product start? to market, isn't it? It's not been out too long. It's not been out too long. It's kind of crept in and obviously all the COVID things going on and then stores reopening. It's kind of just getting in there now for everyone to go, hi, come and look at me. Come and look at the Gazelle. <laughs> now, we've, oh, we've sold quite a few in store. People love it once and it's been great having people into store yeah. people testing it on the test track and learning a little bit more yeah. about the gazelle so we've got it here just in one of the modes haven't oh we oh god this 23 configuration have you learned them all off by heart Can i'm not gonna you? lie i've not done all of them yet maybe but it's i've done the majority but yeah it's getting used to it not only that like i said we've been kind of in our little houses and i've been trying to test it but i've had building work going on and ladders so it's kind of been like yeah uh, <laughs> coming give, into store and using give it us more a thumbs up <laughs> if you think we should make melissa do as many oh, configurations no. as possible <laughs> We'll do it between us. Don't worry. We will we'll go do it between through them. Us. So our prize today is a Gazelle S um, with black with the taupe frame. Yes. And this is an independent exclusive, isn't it? Yes. So you'll only find this beautiful colour frame in your little indie stores. So it is a great sort of giveaway today. It is. And it's a little bit different. I know when we unpacked it, when it first came into store a little while ago, Everybody, all the stuff, like, so different, isn't it, the oh. frame? Because we see lots of rose gold. I mean, yes. obviously, our Priam and a Mios on the rose gold. We have that little shiny bit for the shiny we've, mums. Yeah, we've got that, but I love oh, this. And I love the chocolate as well, because there's a lot of people chocolate. that put, mm. like... <laughs> I know that's making me hungry now. Um, I feel like I should have filled this basket more with snacks, but hey-ho, we couldn't eat and, you know... Talk well, to you guys we, today. Will, we will talk about <laughs> snack basket and gazelle basket, the, oh. the baguette basket, <laughs> baguette basket, baguette basket. Because those of you who join us regularly, we do have a little phrase that we look any pushchair that comes in or stroller, 
we look whether the basket is oh. um, baguette friendly. Oh gosh, well feature wise then, this is baguette friendly. You've got your separate basket, nice little handle there. So for anyone wanting to know how much this bag boy takes in the basket, it is 10 kg for your little one. And then for you big super shopper mums, you've then got 13 kg in the bottom basket so as well. So can we take 23 kg of shopping? Well, yeah, I and mean, yeah. you can also put a 22 kg child. Oh, in forget there. the child. I'm more interested in the shopping well, today. Well, I actually was really nerdy this morning, and whilst I had a cup of tea, I quickly looked and thought, right, this whole push chair takes about 57 kg at max. What is that? And it was like a certain breed of dolphin or a moose. A dolphin that moose. you could fit in there, and <laughs> thousands of bags that were school bags. I was like, what take? What is? I the love the equivalent your fact because we've all wandered around with a dolphin. <laughs> but it was it was literally Google how much is 57 kg it's a moose or a dolphin okay <laughs> this pram takes that much <laughs> so um elsa says that's a great size basket for a puppy <sighs> yes those people oh. who those people who joined us in a live a few weeks ago we had we were talking about puppies and <sighs> the girls it wasn't me doing the live said that I wanted a puppy. I only thought about William, your puppy in the basket today. I know, William was behind the camera and was there going, no way, if you still want a job. But guess what, folks? As women always win, because we've now got a puppy. I know, but I actually was like, today I thought in my head when I came here, oh my God, it could we fit in a, a basket. Yeah, she's a Labrador puppy. So yes, yeah, she would it fit in like the basket. It could be like a micro pig in a mug, now. but a puppy in the and basket. And she is less than 10 kg. So actually, we could have brought her in and oh. put her in. But I don't know how that would have gone. It would have been like did 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 running around after a puppy. <laughs> yeah, and, and wipes and poo bags. It's not going to have gone well. We would have actually you. given away free Andrex with it as well. Yeah. <laughs> Here's how some many Andrex? So those of you who've just joined us today, we've got Melissa from Cybex joining us. We're going to be running through one of um, their relatively new products to market, yes. the Gazelle S. So shall we start for those yeah. people who've got one child and are expecting yes. maybe their first child? Definitely. How is this going to work for those parents who have got one child? Well, straight sort of as you see it marketed and pictures and things visual, as I say, we have the basket, we have the seat. So in the box, what you get is your basket, a seat unit that goes from birth up to 22 kg, and then you can do different configurations. So you... So everything you need from birth in yes. your box. Now, I'm sure yes. people have seen we've got a few carry cots behind yes. us, but we'll Hide run in. on to that in a moment. But your seat is suitable from birth. So how are we going to put a child from birth on? Because right. they'd be a bit upright like this. So yeah, yeah, they'd be, be like, ah! yeah, they'd be falling forward. So um, I'll take my basket so you can just lift that off. So when they're a bit older and you're doing the whole shopper mum thing, as I say, you've got your separate basket. But to be fair, even in COVID times, it's quite good to have your own little basket as well. Go around Thank shopping you. separately, do my pram and my basket. <laughs> yeah, and you know, it, it is a very, very useful space and very, very accessible. Yes. So newborn so, using our seat off. unit. So I will run through all the buttons to take it all off and everything. But first things first, if I put it back to single mode and I will go through all of this, but our adapters are so handy. Everything is built into the frame and you can hide the little adapters away. Do you know what? I like that because I'm the kind of mum that would lose an adapter. Oh, literally would lose, would lose one adapter and then <laughs> it's gone stop. under the seat, never to be seen again, or it's fallen somewhere. So our adapters don't leave the push. No, they do don't they? leave the pusher. I mean, the only extra adapters you can purchase is car seat ones, which would be purchased separately. But to put any of your seats and carry cots on, it's all in the so frame. So give us a thumbs up if you think that's a good idea. I wish other yeah. brands did that. I that's know, because sometimes so you have like simple. 40 pairs and you're like, which is this one? Does this go to the top seat? Is that the bottom seat? I just don't know. Whereas this, it's like, hey, do I want my adapter out? Let's just poke it out. It's, it's great nice for, because let's face it, baby brain is real. We've got lots of thumbs up on the fact that we're not going to lose our adapters. Oh. So, so. I will get you to come in a little closer and we'll explain this further as the demo goes on. But um, we have little dots on our frame here and we have a little map, <gasps> sort of a little guide in the bottom of the basket, which shows you what those dots mean. Again, so, great for baby brain. Oh, I, love I love it. it. I love it. So for any of the single mode, we're going to go on to dot number one. Um, for a couple of the double configurations, you go on to number two. 
to have complete sort of space for both children, you go on to dock number three. Because this is a clever pushchair because it's not just for one oh. child. We can carry two children on it, can't I we? I love it. I love it. I mean, you can put two carry cots we're going to show, two seat units, two car seats. And also, for that parent who's perhaps having a second child, already got this, children are outgrowing seats. We also do a boogie board as well. So it's so, so it's gonna, multifunctional. That was a question yes, um, it has that its own somebody one. had asked me a little while ago. And I'm really sorry, I can't find your comment. We've had co questions and we'll run through all the accessories shortly. Um, but, you know, can it's you get a boogie so board? Can you, yes. can, can you get a cup holder? Can you get that? Yes, so that? cup holders. You can also get foot muffs. You can also get little cosy cocoons. Um, we also do all, a range of foot muffs with Cybex. And I'm we just going to move our, our, back yes, a little sorry. bit just so that our cameraman can <laughs> see it nicely there. And we also do adapters so, and all sorts, so yes. So, first child, So we one go child. down to number one. So, on the back of your top adapters, there is a little handy button underneath that you grip and it allows you to move into section number one. Grip and slide. Yes. Grip and slide. Already, Anya spotted the basket this morning. She said that basket is a wicked oh. feature. She loves it. Ashley Crowley loves it. We're getting lots and lots of love for our I gazelle lo this morning. I love the basket. I mean, as a woman, no offence, we love to shop. I know we it's a stereotype, do. but we do. And we there's do. nothing better than a basket. And then when you've got a little one, you've got your shopping, you've got your bags, you've got their changing bag, you've got everything going on. That's perfect. And sometimes you can't access some as well. And well, we're going to see, we're going to test how accessible the basket oh. is in just a moment because we do like a nice accessible basket. Those people who've just joined us, we've got Melissa Hiya. from Cybex with us today. And we are looking at the Cybex Gazelle this yes. morning. And not only that, we are giving one away. Exactly. So keep tuned in. Make sure you ask us lots of questions. All your comments will be entered in a draw to win. Oh. I'm not this one because this is my one okay <laughs> not this one because this is mine but a brand new cybex gazelle yes. s um in the lovely black and top frame which is the one that we've oh. got here so she is rather beautiful so kelly has just said how do we enter to win just you've just already entered kelly you've asked us a you've, there you go. you've asked us a question so thank you very much right so, one child seat. seat unit so you get a lovely large seat unit which i will run through but basically, you would line it up and click it in place, which is nice and easy on that. So this is it in single mode. With all of our seat units as a brand, it's nice and easy to adjust all the harnesses. You've got little clips here, and you can pull everything up, push it down. Quite nice, nice and, and easy. easy. Yeah, I always say everything. when people are in store, one day you've got a snowsuit on, the next day your child's in shorts and t-shirts. Well, definitely in this weather. I mean, I only saw yesterday, apparently we're supposed to have a 16-day heat wave next month. In oh, well, the I news, can't so. wait. I might have 16 <laughs> days off work then. Exactly, get your sunbeds <laughs> ready. Um, so you can adjust all of that. Also, you can move your bumper bar out the way to access the child as well. So a nice gate opening bumper bar. Now, I am noticing that there's lots of white bits on that yes. as well. And I'm assuming white does something, yes. doesn't it? Yes, so it's nice and easy then to point out that everything does something. So I'll go through all the handlebar bits in a moment. Um, but as I say, quite simple. If you're thinking, oh gosh, how do I take this off? Like you said, it's probably why. So to actually take your seat unit off, you press the buttons in and lift. So you just press those two buttons there and lift it so now, as I say, if we are using this from newborn yes. this seat is suitable from newborn we do need to have it completely flat don't we yes so, so completely just, flat just bring it back a little yeah, bit yeah. and then we can show our camera can see it is a nice lay flat yes. position now with a newborn in a seat unit we do have to use the harness yes correct but there are that an option if people want a carry cart which we'll oh. show in just a moment yes and even like i said for the mums that perhaps maybe don't want to carry cock because of space or you know you can't fit it all in the car you can get little cozy cocoons foot muffs that can go as the child grows keep it a bit nice and warm bit more protected from the elements yes isn't it? exactly so you've got a nice large hood as well and i'll show how we folded the seat back in a second but you can actually unzip your hood and when they're laying down you've got that nice so large now we hood. can imagine that newborn in there yes. protected from the elements yes correct. nice laid flat position <sighs> But even, and you can see from here that that seat is nice and spacious. So as oh. that newborn grows, and they grow very quickly, yes. <laughs> very, very quickly, we do have a nice spacious seat, don't we? Yes. And what weight does this seat unit go up to? So I say it goes up to 22 kg. So as I say, that's roughly about four years old. Um, 
with our seats, as I say, they are quite large as a brand in total. Um, we like to make a nice big seat unit because not only do the kids grow quite tall in our European countries as well, they grow even taller. Even taller than us, Melissa. Yeah. Yes. Yeah. <laughs> Maybe not at four, but they do grow incredibly quickly. Now, Tracy Cowton has joined us in a moment. She says she still loves a carry cot for a newborn. Yeah. And yes, lots yeah. of people do. You know, a carry cot is oh, an essential for many parents. It's gorgeous, parents. though, you know, as well. I, I, I am a carry cot fan. But for some people, just storage space yes. and budget, you know, and lifestyle yeah. means that they're not going to go for the carry cot. So exactly. it's nice to have that option of a seat unit that goes from birth. Well, that's the thing with our products in general. We always offer multiple options. We don't say, hey, this only goes from six months. You have to buy this, you have to buy that. It's completely tailored to you as a customer, what your lifestyle needs, offers, budget, things like that. So um, Chloe, Ellen, Alice Fenton is asking, how do, small does it fold? Oh. How quiet, Chloe? We will come to that I shortly. know. She's like, she's really excited and so she, am I. I'm like, let's do it all. But we've got to, got to take our time with this product. There's so much for it that we've got to take our time. <laughs> so we've got nice ventilation at the back yes. for the three summer days of the year that we do have. <laughs> yes. And for the rest of it, we can fold it down and keep baby nice and warm. Exactly. And I like that when we show it um, world facing, that's a cheeky little peekaboo pocket. Yep. So when they're facing away from you, you can check what they're up to as well. Um, so as I say, you can zip that up with any of our hoods and car seats, um, hoods as well. They are UPF 50, so they are sun protected. And also all of our covers are machine washable at 30 degrees. Oh, we do love that. Thank, thank you, thank you. As a mum of three children, I do like something that is machine washable. I, I mean, I'm, I'm all for washing by hand, but if I can put it in the machine. Yes, and with ours as well, um, we would then say, with the car seat covers, pop them on when they're slightly damp or they've been warm on a radiator, easier to get them on. But as I say, That's all washable. That's a good tip. Because, tip. you know, I'm, I'm not being funny, but I mean, we've got a couple of car seats out today. Yes. But putting your car seat covers back on. I've never really tried it is, yet. <laughs> well, OK, I will tell you that it is a challenge. And it is a challenge for, I'd say, pretty much all car seats. Yes. So we always say to people, as you're taking them off, because babies have leaky nappies, yep. they're sick. As you're taking them off, think about how you're taking them mm -hmm. off because you're going to do it in reverse when you're putting them yep, back on. Yep. And Google is your friend if you get stuck. <laughs> it really is. Well, I say it gave me that dolphin fact this your morning. Dolphin <laughs> fact. I love your dolphin fact. So to lift it up, just at the back, there is a nice, easy gripping section there. So we've got a few recline positions. So if I show you again there. So it's nice and easy to do that. I'll just pop it back up again. So even when the seat is upright, if I just show the hood one more time, if the child was, as I say, on a hot sunny day out and about, you've got that nice coverage just there. And like I said, ventilation at the top. So it's really nice sun, sun canopy. And you can also pop this little flat back as well. So if you don't want the extra bit in the way, you can have it out if needed or not. And it's nice the back will zip yeah. up. And we often find that older toddlers are the ones who sort of hit Put, put the hoods back, they get a bit yeah. fed up and they're like, get that hood out of my way. <laughs> like, I want to see everything. But our youngsters, that coverage, and also if you are out and about, maybe you're yeah. on holiday, going out for a meal, having a large hood is a nice dark oh. environment because hopefully little one will sleep while you have a nice adult meal. I know, and you just got me like excited about meals and holidays. <laughs> it's all happening again. <laughs> like, do you like my plan that yeah, child yeah. will sleep? Yes. It happens, but, you know. Exactly. Um, just here as well, another white buttons again. So you can actually adjust the leg rest as they get older so the little legs can pop down nice and easy. And obviously, like I said, it's all washable and wipeable, so you can give that a nice clean if they've got dirty little shoes because they've been playing on the park. Um, to then switch the seat unit around, as I say, you press those two buttons in and you can lift it off and then you can turn it round to go world facing. Now, what I think is a great feature, and to be fair, I don't think sometimes we shout enough about this with our products, going on to your eating out, it's actually at high chair height. So if yeah. you were to go into a cafe or restaurant, you can't get hold of a high chair. Or, could, I'm not being funny, but some of them are dirty. Some of them are not nice. No, no some of them no, are not, not too not nice. nice. And we've said no. we can wash this, so. And, <laughs> and during COVID, yeah. at least you know your child's in their own environment. Yeah. So I think I would be tempted to do that. Now, we've got a couple of people asking about the handlebar and whether it will adjust. So yes. perhaps while we've got these questions coming yeah. in, handlebar, can we adjust it, Melissa? Yes, so there's a button just on the underneath. 
So what you do is grip that and it does adjust. So if that was quite tall, I could be quite tall. You're not really I, that tall, no, are you? I wish I no, was. No, no. <laughs> but you can adjust it at multiple heights by just gripping that section there. So it's quite nice and easy to do that. Um, we understand, as I say, that we need that space, especially if we do have the buggy board on that's designed for the pram. You've got so that you space. So you do your own yes. toddler board as well, own don't you? I want specifically for this, and then we do some for our other products as yeah, well. Which so. is great, because if you use a toddler board that is by the brand, yeah. you're not going to invalidate your warranty. Whereas exactly. you can use Universal on a lot of products, but it will invalidate the warranty oh, of your especially chassis. Especially if it bends it, it's not correct. It's yeah, a so they of, yeah. are safety tested with these. Yes. So we always recommend to people that if a brand does their own toddler board, use that one because we know it's been tested. The push is always a lot better um, and it doesn't invalidate your warranty. Exactly. Talking of warranty, does this come with a warranty? Um, so yes, on our push chairs, I believe it's two years, but I'll double check because it's three years on our car seats. I yes. just can't recall off the top of my head if I've, as I say, they're both the same, but as I say, unless they've updated it, two years on the... So... Three years on the car seat. Once we've got little one facing the world, yeah. we have got a nice big seat, haven't they? Oh. So we can now imagine that child in. Yes. And we've still got great access to the basket. Oh, yeah. Now, my favourite feature about the basket is the fact that you've got all the instructions on there. I, know. I do love it. I love it. I love it for demoing because, as I say, especially when you're getting used to it, it's all there nice and clear. There's nothing worse as well for you guys that if you buy a product, you've had the great service in store, they follow up after. Hopefully. But sometimes, yeah, but sometimes it's a case of you couldn't get in, baby comes quicker than anticipated, you get it all out the box, you build it, two months later you might forget how to sort of function and I'm not the first few funny. bits people do not read their instructions <sighs> well it depends how good the instructions are <laughs> but people do not read their instructions but so we've got budget. a few people who've just just joining us if you're a little bit late to the party we will forgive you yeah. just this once just this once just this once but today we've got <laughs> melissa the lovely melissa hello from cybex you. And she has brought in, well, no, you've not brought it in. Well, I did bring ours. one, but you we brought we, one, but yeah. we haven't got one. <laughs> um, the lovely um, Cybex Gazelle. And yes. we are giving away a single push chair today worth £619.95. And it came with this basket if anyone was not watching beforehand. We'll put it back to the basket shortly. <laughs> so, for those parents who perhaps they're buying it as a single, yep. but they would like a carry cart, yeah. have we got the option to add yes. a carry cart? I did know the answer to that one, but I just thought I'd ask Yeah, you, you just anyway. thought I'd ask anyway. Well, we've got two carry carts, so we'll be showing a little later on with two. But you've got a lovely carry cot here, lovely size with our carry cots um, to take it off and on as well. You've got a nice carry handle up here because most brands pop it a bit lower. Yeah. But for support, we find it a bit better to have the handle up here. So if I was to take it off again, I'll pop it back on again. But what we've got is memory buttons. <gasps> I so love a memory button. I know. Button. So you press one and two. A funky button remembers it's closed and then it lets you lift it off. So then I can lift it off and pop it down on the floor. And I've got some nice hard bottom and I've got some studs on it as well so it can sit on the floor. Um, so with regards to our carry cots, we wouldn't necessarily recommend sort of using them overnight. But you could use it throughout the day if you go to a friend's house yep. or something, you know. Um, it's nice breathable fabric in there, um, which I will show you. And yet again, machine washable. We got, like that. People are loving the memory buttons. Give us a thumbs up if you love a memory button, because I certainly do love a memory button. Yes, now it this makes it is, easier. We, I see a lot of carry cots. We've got over 300 push chairs and car seats Gosh, on display. Gosh, how many? Yeah, in fact, well over 300. Now, this is a brilliant size oh, for a carry cot, isn't it? It's so nice and deep. It's, it's as I really say, cushioned. Deep quite large I mean what you often get is carry cots have to round off or become a bit shorter for the size of frame but because we've got quite a wide frame on this product and it's super soft so if yeah. one rolls over this is oh, this is really it's really safe. soft cotton got breathable or washable as a well a lovely mattress as well yes so it is really nice and I could just pop back the buttons there you would just pop Look your buttons there. Look at the thumbs up we're getting for oh. memory buttons. Look, we've even got a heart as well. Oh, because it's just so great. There's nothing worse, especially if you're a second time mum as well and you know it all, is you're trying to put a product down in the rain or you've got shopping, you've got a toddler and you're trying to get those buttons and they're just not doing what you want. Whereas them, one and two, 
one and Take two, it off. off you go. Yeah, there you go. And baby brain, as we've said, is real. It really <laughs> is real. And you've got the little air ventilation on the back of there yet again. And also you've got a tiny little sun visor on the front. which And it is quite away. nice because if we pull it all the way up, oh, it's, it's nice and tidy, no yeah. fluffy fabrics. No, and fluffy I do fabrics. like it all to be nice and oh, tidy. I mean, with, with ours, it is a lot. It's either magnetised or you can pull it nice and tidy. There's never that sort of annoying bit flapping everywhere in the wind. And as I said, you can pop that little sun bit back out the way as well just so you can see the child if you need to. So price-wise, um, if we're looking at the top, which is the one that we've got out today, which is an independent exclusive, is 61995 as a single. With your carry cart, it's 83990. Okay, just for those people who are asking about prices. There yes. are some other colours available, aren't yes, there? Yes, there's multiple colours. We've got some new ones coming out Oh, well. have you? Can you give us a secret? Can we have a secret reveal? <sighs> oh, I've not got one with me, but it's got some beige ones coming oh now i hope nobody's watching at cybex so we've got a little <laughs> bit of a secret here this kind of beigey torpy color is very very on trend oh. we're seeing a lot of it coming through this year yes a lot of launches coming through yes i actually think it's going to be the new gray oh, i love it it's especially when you see it as well it's like a khaki beige color it is really nice that sort of neutral color without it yeah just being black well black or gray it's kind of that nice Hey, gender neutral, but a bit fun. Yeah. So, carry cot. We've said we've had the seat unit, yep. haven't we, for one child? Yeah. But a lot of people will like that carry cot yes. mode initially. I have to say, I'm a carry cot mum, but I've got I've got big boots. Yes. So lots of space in my car. But if I had a small car, then obviously your seat unit oh. will go from birth. So you have got yep. that option, haven't you? And then we've got our car seats, which we can discuss a little bit as well in a bit. Now, um, the thing I like about having a seat from birth is you suddenly go off to Ikea. You can't fit your carry cot oh. in, but you can put your child <laughs> in your seat unit yeah. with none of that parental guilt of, do you know what, they shouldn't really be yeah, in there yeah. yet. Yeah, yeah. So a bit exactly. of flexibility. Exactly. And the carry cot goes up to 9 kg in weight, which we roughly say is six months, but it does depend on whether your little one grows quite tall or if they're a bit nosy, if they want to start popping their head up and seeing the world. But it's nice because if you, you know, have got a little one who's a bit nosy, I don't think they're going to outgrow the carry no, cot. No, no, they don't tend months. to. And nine kilograms is actually your average nine month old, yeah. which is a big percentage of your child's life at that point. But you have obviously got yeah. the option to take them back to that seat that you can use from yeah, birth. Yeah, exactly, exactly. So that is the lovely carry cot. So can we have a look at the fold? For those parents yeah. who are having it as a single, how okay. does she fold? So the question is then, do you want me to show it without the seat Let's folded? do it without the seat okay. first. Let's, let's, do it. let's do them both. Let's do them both. That is another great feature, ladies and gentlemen. We'll show you in a bit, but you can actually fold it with a seat unit on, which is great. Not having to take mm -hmm. extra bits off, you can just fold it. But with our Cybex products, we always have two buttons to be able to do the fold. But with this particular product, we've also got a third safety catch in there. Reason for that, you've got the weight of two children. You don't want to accidentally catch anything and it folds. No, never so, fold your children in a pushchair. No, 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 <laughs> no. no. Always take your children out. <laughs> so what we do with this one is you've got a bit for your thumb and a bit just here. So what you do is slide that with your thumb and grip. And then you can see it still doesn't fold. So what I have to do is press this catch, give it the slightest bit of a tap down. And there we go. And we've also got just here a little safety catch that it will fall into. And then you can have it as all one piece. So that's nice. It's not going to unfurl as you try and get it in and out of the no. boot. Now, as we can see, it self stands. And I the know. other thing you might not be aware of are little phrases that we use. Oh, here we go. And here we go. I'm ready. You ready? It's got a really nice tummy gap. A tummy gap? Yeah, lift it up as if you're putting it in the car that way. Ooh. Oh, oh, Melissa. I'm just pulling a leg. I right. want her to do it. Yeah. So we're tummy putting gap. it in the car. Yeah. You've got your tummy gap. So oh for my those goodness. people, you've got your weight. I actually love that. Based. I've never Look, seen this. The tummy gap. Melissa, your life has now changed. I know, but I see you guys live and I must just miss that little bit. How did you miss the tummy gap? I mean, Gosh. this is a lockdown tummy gap. It depends. Oh my goodness, how yeah. Tummy I've, is. Look, I've got a flaky dress to give the illusion there's not a tummy. Uh. <laughs> And while I've got it up here, look, we can see the suspension at the front. I don't know if oh. our cameraman can come a little bit closer. And I can still carry it because it's not that heavy. No, it's quite a light product for a double. It's going to have to be chunky because it's got to take two children, isn't it? You know, yeah. so they're not going to be as light as some of them. 
but she's not heavy. I mean, look. Woo! Look at this. <laughs> she's like, look. I've had my wheat bix this morning. I have. <laughs> I have. I have. So I'm going to give that back to you, Melissa. Thank just you. Taking over your demonstration, but you now have to add the word tummy gap. Into oh, all tummy your gap! I love that. I've learned something today. We, we might pa we might patent it though. Sorry. Oh. Gosh. Well, we patent a lot of things, so there we go. <laughs> I'll quickly just see thinking. any of my bosses hear it. Quick, quick, patent it. You know, no. we've got Tommy Gap. <laughs> no, they'll do it quicker than me. That's no good. That's no good. Oh. Emma says it looks brilliant and light. Emily ba Brain says she loves how small and light the fold is. It is a very easy yes. fold. Jolene has shared this morning. <gasps> Jolene, thank you. Oh, that's making me think of a song as well. Jolene, 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 Jolene. We should go out. We should go out disco there dancing. Go. We should start singing. Maybe not. <laughs> Maybe not. But Jolene has shared, so thank you very much. And she says she loves the colour of the frame. Oh, it's yeah. nice. It's, it's just, just different, isn't it? Yeah. We did have a question earlier. Can you get the frame in any other colours? Yes, you can get it in black colour as well, uh, with a black foam handle. So there's the two colours at the moment. Um, on some of our other products, we offer a few other colours, but on this one, as I say, we've got the beautiful taupe and we have the black frame. I'm, I'm, a, I'm a taupe lady. Yeah, I'm like, yeah. I'm a taupe lady. Yes, I love it. When I unboxed it for the first time, it's very different when um, we get our products and even before you guys get to see them, we get them out and I was like, oh, I've never seen quite a colour like it. It's not too shiny silver, it's not chrome, no. it's like nice in between. It's very classy yeah. and classical i think and particularly yeah. with the chocolate handle now the black one obviously you've got you're all black so some yes. people love that all black yeah. look yeah. and you've got a black foam yeah. handle i mean i'm happy if our winner decides that they love the all black i'm quite happy to swap from the top because we want yeah. them to be happy exactly. we want them to be happy got a few questions about car seats so we'll run on to car yes. seats in just a little while so we did mention that we can fold it just with do the catch the seat unit on. Yes. So, so, shall we have a look at that? Yes. So, you can fold it in both directions, but just for the purpose of the video, I will do it in this way, just because it makes me think of how I do it. Um, but, to fold it with a seat unit on, you've got your recline clip yet again on the back. So, what you do is grip that and push the seat all the way over. And then, like we did again, with your thumb and grip there, Grip this bit, give it a little tap, and it goes and clicks into place. And you've also then got a carry handle just Which there. Which is nice, isn't it? So it adds a tiny bit of weight, but not a lot, to So some be people honest. will fold it in two pieces, perhaps if you've got a bad back or something like yes. that. Um, but it yeah. is easy to fold in one piece, And it might be it? the habit as well, because yet again with the buttons, if we press the buttons in, we can learn, if I can do it from this angle, it's having a moment. This is your challenge. Oh, you don't, you love live videos. You love live videos. Having a moment. So you can actually then take the seat unit off, flat packed, ready, put that in the car as well, and then have it, you know, And if you separate. are playing boot Jenga, that seat might go behind one of That's, your other yeah. seats in the car. And can we take the wheels off? You can, yeah. So if I just put the frame like this a second. We Let have, me guess, there's something white. Yes, <laughs> you have a white button there, if I can do it from this angle. Is it playing ball again? Or maybe I've locked it into place. Just bear with me a sec, guys. You can't get the stuff so, these days. <laughs> it's me. Oh, no, this white button, sorry, behind here. That was me getting it wrong. That white button just there allows you to take your wheel off so you can clean them and obviously then pop them back on. So you just have to line the shape up and clip it back in. And also all four of our wheels. So if we are playing boot jenga, we don't want to be taking them off very often, do we? Really? No. Because that's just going to be but it's still, annoying. It's still but quick to do. If you need to do it, it's not going to oh, be difficult. I did it today. I did it and was like quick, put my wheels back on because obviously I've got multiple products in the car. It was a lot easier to put them on and take them off just to fit them in the boot. So it does give you that option. So those people who've just joined us, we've got Melissa here from Cybex and we are having a look at one of the new products in the Cybex range, the Gazelle S, and we're giving one away. All oh. you need to do is to add some comments, add us, add some questions. So anybody, as long as you're within the UK, you yes. can win this prize today. So 
while we were looking at the wheels, Holly asks, are the wheels puncture proof? Yes, so they're foam filled, not air filled. Um, so basically they're kind of made from a similar material to the bottom of your trainers kind of material so they're quite hard wearing ah, and as I say a little bit I springy. Like that fact. I'm gonna take a little that bit fact. springy. So it's that nice as I say you haven't got the um, air ones so they're not gonna puncture. So Marta is loving the frame colour. Yeah, I think the, the frame yeah. colour is a real standout feature of this, isn't it? And whilst we're just on the back as well. For us ladies, I mean, today I haven't done it, but when it gets to summer, we've got sandals on, you open really toe shoes. You really flops on, have you? Yeah. <laughs> you can click your brake just like that and it stays locked and then click it again on the top. So it's flip-flop friendly brake, which the people in Germany used to laugh at me for saying, but now they say it all. Yeah, no. Um, You've been but saying it, means... it for 14 years. Yeah, I know, I brakes. know. So we don't have to put a foot underneath and wreck all our shoes and things like that. You can just do it nice and easy. And also, it's then out the way, so if I have got a buggy board on there, I can still access the brake nice and easy. So those people who are asking about ordering, you can either order on the website or just send us a Facebook message. We'll sort it out for you. That is no problem at all. Um, Gemma says she thinks it's great. We've got someone from Cybex in. Melissa is doing great. Hopefully, she's oh, not thank being too much about the fact we don't normally do great. <laughs> No, guys, don't say that, but thanks for at least giving me the confidence because this is the first one I've done I here on the first Facebook Live. you're doing an awesome job. You can just come back every day at half past 11. <laughs> it's fine. Yes, there we go. There I'd we love go. to come you've here just, every day. You've just got yourself a new job. Who knew? <laughs> Sorry, Cybex was stealing her because she's so good. She's so good. <laughs> Leah asks, are the wheels all terrain? Yes, we do class them as an all-terrain wheel. Um, as I say, with some of our wheels, we changed them up a little bit and now we've come up with this nice in between wheel that isn't too big and bulky but still quite sustainable on um, all terrain and then like we were saying before you've got um suspension in the front and then i think i can't recall now if i'm getting mixed up but we should have some sort of shock absorbing in the back as well that's a bit hidden yes it's all in the wheel mechanism at the back with this yes. one so um jackie says those wheels look perfect for countryside walks yes. um ellie woolway i hope we've answered your question because she's asked how good it is for off-roading oh. i mean you're not going to go up a mountain with this we'll face it we'll, we'll be honest you're not going up a mountain but if you're going up a mountain take a baby carrier Yes, or even our electric pram, which or, we could show another day. Yeah, we'll take the e pram. But even so, you're not going to go over your bumps. Uh, yeah, I would still like a little carrier, if yeah, I'm honest. Take a carrier, a take a carrier. If you're going up a mountain, don't try and take a posture. <laughs> so, Jem says it's so nice to have the brands in to demonstrate. Thank you, Melissa. But it is great to be here with Joe And Joe and the team, I love watching their lives. So, I kind of feel like a bit like a fangirl today. I'm a bit like, oh, uh, I bought the live. Yeah, you're, you're <laughs> Pinch me. <laughs> You're, you're in the live. Obviously, you don't watch any of our lives during working hours no, because no, you're too busy. No, I'm not. Yeah. Honestly, <laughs> honestly. So, Jackie Gibson um, asking, what colours does this come in? And she loves this one. So, this is the taupe. Yes. But you can black with the taupe frame, which yes. is our beautiful finish on the frame. But you can also get all oh, black, like can't you? Yeah, there's navies, there's greys. There's, there's all sorts of colours. And we've also mentioned there is new the colours coming. Nice. So keep an I eye do, out. I do like the navy. I think our most popular ones oh. are the taupe and the all black. We've yeah. sold a few navy ones, though. I do love a bit of the navy. It just adds a little bit of bit of a royal royal kind of vibe royal to it vibe. yeah that royal like blue that. i like it we like that so stay tuned we are giving one of these away to somebody in the uk and we will be drawing our winner at the end so make sure that you stay tuned i mean we'll be going through absolutely everything and going through the car seats a little more but like i was saying all the other adapters are built into your frame but your car seat adapters are bought separately so i've got two that i can put in and the way I remember them is the adapter should angle towards you as to which side we I should put want, them in. Yeah, we don't want baby on the head. Yeah, we? pop them in because some people forget which side they go in. And Margaret Carr, just while you grab one of the car seats, I said lots of baguettes and Krispy Kreme will fill in that basket. Oh. We often talk about Krispy Kreme donuts. You know what? We were only giggling about it today, ladies. I'm not going to lie. I walked in today and I filled that basket with a few bickies for the ladies afterwards. And I said... I'm not one of the Cybex models with the baguette and flowers in. I've come with goodies in our basket <laughs> we like today. Goodies. We like goodies. We definitely like goodies. Kim Nichols has said, this has taken over as my favourite from this live. Thank you for oh. so much detail. I'm due in November and I can't believe how many there are. Yes, there are oh. a lot of pushchairs. 
Kim, so if many. we can help, just give us a shout. Just give us a shout. So we've got here, I'm going to say it's our most popular Cybex infant carrier. I'm, I'm, I'm going yes. to put it out there, but for us in store and online, it is our most popular yeah. Cybex infant carrier. And I mean, carrier. if you're feeling funky, there's the autumn gold. Um, we do do other colours, greys, navies, yeah, again, we do khaki, we do black <laughs> as well. But I kind of like the orange. And you know what I like about our bright colours? kind of shows up in the car as well it's like hey look at me i'm opening my car door i've got a lovely car seat as well as it being safe and the other thing that people often worry about they often think they have to have their car seat to match the fabrics oh. of their pushchair and they're, they're just very lots of people just yeah. think it has to happen but actually we've taken our carry cut off our seat unit even if it was bright pink with um blue polka yeah. dots on it you can't see your fabrics yeah. and now it really doesn't matter i mean i've seen this out and about recently quite a lot on black frames because it yeah. kind of pops a bit more so we have as i say got the black one behind and we'll show um both of them but this is the cloud z it is the first rotating and lay flat infant carrier on the market so it lays flat on the chassis yep. but not in the car correct so a lot of people get that a little bit confused yes here. so for us it's more a uh, feature of hey i'm out and about i've got to pop in and grab a con click and collect order pop it on my yeah. ram lay it down i'll quickly go grab that from the shop it's that kind of and it's nice because it does alleviate that parental oh. guilt doesn't it and it yes. you do feel guilty as a parent because we know that for the first six months of baby's life they should yeah. be lay flat yes but there are times when the convenience of popping your infant carrier on the chassis of your pushchair is going to help. Doctor's appointments, those. things like that, quick school, taking older siblings to school, yeah. things like that. But the nice thing is we can recline it. Can we pop it on the chassis yeah, and have a look? Yeah, sure. So if I've got my adapters in and I look that side, you hear that nice click? So we've got it in. So the lay flat function is just here. So what you do is I always put my thumb on this little ridge here. And I grip this section here, and then what I do is push it away from me, and that's in the lay flat position. So it is a true lay flat car seat. It is tested, as I say, to alleviate the time limits. And what you can do as well is pop your handle all the way out the way as well. So it's quite nice and funky and stylish, as it well is. as being practical. You know, it, it really, really is. And what is quite nice is we do love the shape of it. I know yeah. people go, well, you shouldn't be about how your car seat oh. looks. But if we've got a nice, safe car seat and it looks pretty, yes. I mean, it gives us a double whammy, really. For anyone that's new looking at Cybex today, that is the biggest thing for us is it's no compromise. So it's always the safety first. But we like to look a bit cool as well. So it's, it's about adding that little bit to you as and a mum because you want to... You want to feel great and pick what's for you, you as well. And the other thing is we've looked at this kind of funky autumn gold here. I'm just going to move her back a little bit. But if you want to go really funky, there are some amazing oh. designs um, for this it's seat, crazy aren't there? stuff. I mean, I if, mean you, really crazy. if you've been big on social media and having a little look around while she's been sat at home these days, we've just done with DJ Khaled um, a collection as well with That's all parrots and... Just lions and it? it's just crazy really really different you've had some crazy designs uh, there is the, the blossom design which oh. is it's not i'm not going to say it's not crazy but it's really yes. different with the flowers on it as well and there's some new stuff coming yep. in the future that's really funky as well yeah so even if for some people they might not be brave enough to do that with a whole push yeah you could do it with a car, you seat. Could do it with your car seat i mean i love as well there was a katie perry one recently and it gives that mickey mouse mini mouse kind of vibe and it's red and white and cute and it says everything looks good with a bow or better with a bow. Absolutely. <laughs> Life is complete with a bow. We should have put bows in our hair. Oh, we, yeah, I think we That's... could have had matching and just, yeah. it would have finished the, Life the would, whole thing. Life would have been <laughs> absolutely complete. So there are lots and lots of different designs yes. on your Cybex Cloud Z. Now it is an ISI seat, isn't it? Yes. So it's met all the latest regulations. Yes. And the main thing to know as well, we've looked at this recently with um, studies regarding the height of children and how they're growing. And this seat actually goes up to 24 months. So, so yeah, for an infant carrier, that it's is big, great. Isn't it? Yeah, it's, and you know, it is really, it is a big seat. So often when we have parents who come into store, and they're a little bit taller than average. Yeah, you know, a little bit taller. <laughs> we need to make sure that hopefully they've got that longevity yes. of their their pushchair and their car seat. But one of the nice things about Cybex is there's nothing 
petite. Yeah. And, and it's dainty, but not petite. So yeah, we yeah. know that we're going to get the longevity and the value for money from it. And we've got all the nice little inserts as well that can take out as the child grows. So we have a newborn insert, roughly comes out about four months. But there is, with our stuff as well, always handy labels. So yet again, we were talking about labels being there. It does tell you when the height, you know, they need to take that insert out. So everything's machine washable and it's such a soft, comfy fabric as well. A really good question from Joanna Bailey. Good morning, Joanna Bailey, or maybe afternoon. I don't know what time it is. I'm going to say good afternoon. <laughs> I feel like we've been going for ages, but I don't want it to stop. No, no, no. Joanna says, can we lay the car seat flat when baby is already in it? Yes, you can. Um, so with regards to the mechanism, it's sort of the, where the bum section is. It sort of moves ever so slightly. <laughs> and with our harnesses as well, they're all attached to the headrest, so as the seat extends, if I just do it again, as the seat extends, and if I move the pad, you might be able to see it a little more, you can see that section there comes out nicely. And then, as I say, the newborn insert obviously supports the um, back of the little one as well, so it gives it that more flat position for them. So Marta M. Cox says, German engineering is great. Oh, yeah. I mean, if we listen to our partners and husbands and everything else, they're car, car, car mad, and it tends to be the German ones it, as well. <laughs> yeah, we, we're not going to lie. We're not going to lie. That is definitely the case. So this seat that we've been looking at is the Cybex Cloud Z, yes. which is an eye-size seat. Are there any other Cybex seats that we can put on the chassis yes. of the Gazelle? So I've got one behind me as well. Ta-da! Ta Here's one I made earlier. I feel like it's Blue Peter. It is. <laughs> but we're not going to bake. No, we're not going to make because no. they have to be tested and safety standards. <laughs> yeah, no, no. We can do car seats and we can do push chairs, Sorry. but baking, I'm not sure about doing that live. I'll just take this one off. Um, but another thing to know is, like I said before, UPF 50 hoods. They're a nice, breathable, bouncy fabric. So it doesn't matter in the vehicle where you have that because it is a nice, breathable fabric and protects them from the sun. And it's also great that it's separate to the handle because some seats you have to hook your hood up onto the handles yep. there. You can't have the handle out the way. Um, so as I say, it's all nice and easy to adjust. And one last thing that we'll go through later on anyway, but we've got this nice funky bit that you pop out on the side, which people can see on that side is an extra safety feature. So we pop that out when they're fitted <laughs> it's, in the vehicle. It's not to hit the eyes out of little children no, who are walking you past know, your bus chair. Yeah. Like you're in the car. <laughs> and some people have said as well, oh, does that help with the social distancing? Does that hey! help keep people away from me in a supermarket? <laughs> so no. you need a button. But when you go out into the supermarket, you press the button. Yeah. Five X, this is a great plan for you. It goes out two <laughs> metres and keeps people well away from I know, your child. I know, but then we can't, we'll probably, and then it has to extend then possibly to six metres if they change it again, then four, then three, then two. <laughs> but yeah, you pop that out on the side nearest the car door. So if there was an accident from the side, that takes a bit of the shock first. And then the energy will cascade through the shell. And then why people might question that the newborn insert has a bit of um, hardness to it on the sides is that's another layer of absorbing protection as well just on there. So, so anything that is an eye size seat. So historically, yes. I'm going to say old regulations of yeah, the new yeah. eye size because it makes it a little it bit easier. It gets so confusing otherwise. So old regulations, car seats were tested front and rear impact. Yes, anything that correct. is an eye size seat has met the latest standards. Correct. Okay. And so that's front and rear impact plus side impact. Yes. Plus rollover. Yeah. Plus the dummies they use for the testing. I've got oh, loads more sensors got in all them. Sorts so it's going a on. really big jump. So we always recommend to people, you know, if your budgets do allow, look at the eye size ranges of seats. Yes. Um, but as I say, just for even people that have a lower budget, in general, our seats, which we've always put this side impact on them as yes. well we've always tried to do the best testing we can um, but as I say it just happens to be that the two products I'm going to show are eye size um, but just another quick one on ours before I take it off just in general with our car seats there's a little button on the inside of here to pull on your harnesses and then you can pull that nice and tight now some people worry about pulling that too tight they do as I but say, it's okay. yeah, if you give it a nice little pull and then it's say it should sit nicely on the child's chest, we've got these little pads there to keep them safe. And also on the back here, we've got a little ring that you will adjust and that moves your harnesses up with it. So you haven't got to rethread and we every time like they get bigger, well, they grow all the time. So if you've got to like every setting, move your no, harness up, it gets like a bit of a faff. So Liz is saying, um, is this seat Isofix or seat belt? Um, you can do either or, but to the eye size standard, it has to be on an Isofix base. 
Um, here's but, one I prepared earlier. Yeah, here's one we prepared earlier. But you can seat belt it. Um, you cannot seat belt it laying flat in the vehicle, like we were saying before. And actually, the seat doesn't let you. So even if I laid it flat, where you would put your seat belt, the little red indicators come out to stop you from actually seat belting it laying flat. So again, that baby brain, or if grandparents have got them and they're yes. not quite used to it, it does mean so you can't seat belt it in if it's laid flat and you can't yeah. physically get it on your isofix base. So you can't get it wrong. Exactly. And to take it off, you press these buttons on the inside. So I always do one side, swap my hand and then press <laughs> the other. And that one's decided to clip in whilst I've taken the time to tell you. <laughs> And with um, any of our um, infant carriers as well, I always think a great tip that we miss a little bit is if you put your arm through there and hold where your car seat adapter goes, if you rest it on your hip, it's actually a bit lighter to carry it just, than at the end of your arm. Yeah, and you've got well. a nice straight spine as well, haven't you, when yes. you're doing this? So this is the Cloud Z, but today we're really, really focusing on our Cybex Gazelle S. She's a little bit naked here because she has nothing on her. Yes. But we are giving one away, a single um, Gazelle S today in the black and the taupe frame. It is a, you've got a seat unit that is suitable from birth. You've got your large basket at the bottom. You've also got your little basket as well. Yes. And obviously your rain covers because it does rain occasionally. Yeah. So, so, okay, so we've looked at it for one child. What happens if another child comes along? Oh, what well, are we going to do? Well, that does happen. A lot of kids can be, uh, you know, close together in age. And it's great as well for those parents that say, hey, I know I want to start a family. I know I relatively want the kids close together. Can I have a product that offers me that option in the future? Well, it does without having to buy loads of extra bits for and it. And it kind of just future-proofs it. And for a lot of our parents coming in, you know, you say to them, have you thought, are you going to have another child? The dads tend to run out and go, oh my goodness. I know, they look the at you white go, in the face and go, oh. The mums go, oh, let's just get this one out first. Yeah, yeah. But, you know, a lot of families are planning, a lot of people yeah. are planning on two children yeah. or what. If we have two children, it works amazingly well as oh, a yeah. single. Really, yes. really well as a single. But you have got that future proofing, yeah. haven't you? And I mean, for those customers that we're talking about before buying a carry cot, although the seat is from birth, if you have purchased a carry cot, then actually, if you were to have a second child, you've got it set ready for a double anyway, because you could have your carry cot on the top, your toddler on the bottom, and then when your toddler outgrows it, you can then put the seat yeah. unit up, have it as a single, and, and then even the use a board. Yeah. So often you won't need to buy anything at all. Somebody's asked about the extension kit. Um, is that available separately? I think, I'm not sure whether you mean an extra seat or I an think, extra carry cot, yeah. or whether it's just converting what you've got yeah. into so two. So we're about so, to go through it. Yeah, all our adapters are there, aren't they? Yeah, so with some brands, you do have to purchase extra adapters to make this into a double. But like I was saying before, as are here. So if I press this button in here, you can then turn your adapters around, if I can get to it. So you don't side. lose them in the two years no. between having your children, you don't lose your adapters. I no. like it. So you've got your adapters there. We were saying before, which I'm going to run through, You've got your configurations in the basket, so we've just done all the single modes, and now we can look at the other two um, lots of uh, sort of setups. Let's say it does 23 setups. I mean, if 23. you want to tune into us all day, we could perhaps go through all of them. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, but they'll have all eaten all the biscuits in the office. I if know. We do that, so we're not going to do. We're not going to do all 23. So, so slid and one up. Talking of surprises, Jo says she had a surprise number four. 10 years after what was supposed to have been her last child. Oh, gosh. Surprise! Surprise! <laughs> um, and Marissa Mackinnon, I hope I said that right, Melissa, uh, Marissa, sorry, this morning, said so she wishes she had thought ahead when she had her first. Um, yeah. Yeah, it, yeah no. It's one of those mixtures because you have your first child and it's great, oh, my gosh, I need to get yeah. everything. The grandparents want to get things. And then sometimes you go for pretty and what you want initially without even thinking of the second and it's only when you're part way through the pregnancy you might be like oh i oh, want i want oh, two oh, so oh, i want need to one. my first I one's so to... amazing i want another one yeah and, and it's one of those so as i say it's great single and then if if that option happens and it happens then you can convert it into absolutely. a double absolutely somebody's asked where they've got tracy said have we got the boogie board to show us please i haven't got it in the studio today but what we can do is send you some photographs so yes. just send us a message and we'll send um some photographs yes roxanne smith good morning to you she says she is pregnant congratulations oh, well. with surprise number four too <gasps> 
Gosh. I've got three children. <laughs> I hope there's not a surprise I, I haven't four. got any yet, but I still wouldn't know which I side. Could give I, you one. <laughs> I don't know what product I'd have. It'd either be this or, as I say, our lovely Priam. I just don't know. There's so many options. <laughs> So Catherine Horn as well says she wishes she had thought ahead. Hindsight's a wonderful thing. Yeah. It is a wonderful thing. So we've got to, babe, we've got a new baby on yep. the way and our so we've got new baby and toddler. Yep. How are we going to make the Gazelle S work so, for us? Um as I said, if you were to have purchased, say, the carry cot for your first child and you had your seat unit already. You could, as I say, do a setup with these two items. We then can show you in a moment, but you can buy a second seat separately or buy another carry cot, whichever's best for you. I mean, even if you had it in single mode, like I said, our seat units go from birth, so you could even just purchase a separate seat unit if you're not a customer that's wanting carry cot. So, so we did have a couple of questions about, um, I've just got to find them, lots of people saying second came along before the first will be out of the pram, <laughs> so definitely going to need a double. Yeah. Um, Donna says after baby number one, you're so much better prepared, it's only right, I have two. She's got two children. Yeah. So anybody pregnant watching this today, do let us know. We can say congratulations. So we've got Melissa here from Cybex today, and we are looking at our very popular in store, yes. the Cybex Gazelle S. And Absolutely. we're giving a single Gazelle S away today no. worth over £600. All you need to do is add your comments. We're going to be drawing the winner at the end. As long as you're in the UK, because we only ship to the UK, you can enter. If you've hit share, thank you very much. Do do tell us if you shared so we can say thank you. So, so I two will, children. How right. are we going to do it? So if we go for a carry cot first, like I was saying before, you've got your three options of height that correspond with what um, you can actually put the configuration of. So if I go to number three, that means I can put a lot of my double seats, double carry carts and things together. So I've put it at the highest. So what I'll do first is, I mean, I'll put the carry cot on the bottom, but you can have it either or. So I'll show both ways. I can see from my side. So, yes, you. somebody has asked whether we can do twins on yes. this push chair. You can. Yes. We'll show you twins in a moment. Um, but it's here we go. We've got two children. If I can get my adapters the right way now from where I demoed get, it. We, they do spin around, don't they? So you <laughs> do need to it's line those up. Yes. So once I've lined those up, what I can have is, as I say, you can have the baby on the, the newborn on the top as well. But that's just one setup. Like I said, there's 23. Can I borrow this? Because yeah, a lot of people, it. I'm gonna. A lots of people when they come into store, they're expecting the second child and they're looking at different setups. So a lot of people will say, "Oh, I, I want my baby at the top yeah, and my yeah. toddler at the bottom." However, my bit of advice is. Your baby will sleep a oh, lot, yes. fingers crossed, when they are in your pushchair. And you can see them. You've just got to move yep. your head to the side. And to be fair, your you can toddler, pop this down. on the other hand, is perhaps feeling a little bit pushed out because new babies arrive. Yeah, yeah. You're feeding your you feeding newborn an awful lot, whether you're breastfeeding or whether you're formula feeding. When you go out walking, knowing that baby is asleep, because yep. they do sleep so well in their prams, it's a nice one-to-one -one time yes. with your toddler. So as a mum. Historically, before I kind of went through that process, I'd have gone, I have to have baby there and yep. toddler there. But actually, this is a really good oh. quality time with your toddler. Exactly. And like I said, you can pop the hood back. That's part way. And you can also pop it back the whole way. So if needs be, you wanted to be able to access and see baby a bit more, you can. Or as I say, you can pop the hood all the way back up. For the usual British yeah. weather. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, now, rain covers British. are included with yes, this, Yes, they, they are. Yes. So Talking of say, British weather. Rain covers included. As I say, it is a shower-proof fabric and it is UPF 50. But yes, if it's absolutely raining cats and dogs, we're going to have to put a rain cover we on We are. It. Let's face it. Let's face it. And it does rain occasionally. So, it does. so I just wanted to point that out because a lot of people yeah. ha have that thought of, but I can't. I, yeah. I, I want my baby closer no, to definitely. me. But it's really good quality time with your toddler. That's the thing because they're the ones that are developing and being like, oh, I can see everything. I want to start talking. I want to ask questions. Exactly. I want this. I want food. Whereas baby, it's like, hey, I feed you. You have a little sleep. You have a little sleep. Uh, you know, and, and toddlers, 
often the older sibling does feel a little bit pushed out with newborn oh, babies. Oh, I don't know, I was the first. You know, <laughs> well, I can remember with my two, you know, my both uh, got yeah. a newborn baby and suddenly yeah, the first child wanting to hold has had all one, that yeah. time of you and then a new baby comes along, they can't have 100% of that yep. time naturally, so it is a nice good quality yeah. time. Sorry, I... I, no, I it's a joint demo. demo. It's a joint... Do you think oh, I'll spin around. <laughs> it's so good, I want it back! <laughs> So to take the curry cut off, press one and two memory buttons yet again. And then I've got that nice handle just there to lift that up. Like I said, you can then have, for example, let's pop it this direction. Kim Nichols has said, you won't get chance to ask me when we come in if we're going to be having any more. My husband will tell you it's his fifth, my third, and the last with crying face. <laughs> But I absolutely love this. <laughs> <laughs> That's it. You go into store and you see something you love. It's, it's like you've got to try and get it. <laughs> you've, just, you've just got to. So Tamay Hoffer has joined us and their question this, this afternoon is, what is the handle made of? Good question. Leatherette finish, I believe. Yes, it is indeed. Leatherette. Jennifer Alice says this is an amazing price. Marta Cox has said, is there a weight limit? Um, we were discussing this earlier, so each seat unit takes 22 kg. Your bottom shopping basket takes um, 13, and then the other little basket we showed earlier takes 10, and your carry cot 9. So, like, well maximum. Done. Well done. <laughs> yeah, got it, 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 right. it, it. it right. Got it right. Got it right. Got it right. Got it right. So, it takes about 57 maximum, which is two seats and 10 kg basket. So what I would say as well, one of the nice things about this product is, and we'll pop two seats on in just a moment, if you've got two seat units on a lot oh. of push chairs, it takes your, even if it's a 22 kg yep. weight, on not all, but on quite a lot of our tandem yep. push chairs, it will then take your weight down to 15 yes. kg. Whereas on this, we it's still like, maintain still. 22 kg for both seats. So great if you've got twins as well. Yes. Um, and if anyone has tuned in who is having twins, like we were discussing earlier as well, we also do the lay flat cloud Z. So quite a lot of twin customers like to get, obviously, the two lay flat seat units for as they get bigger. But they also like the option that if they're limited on space, quick popping out, that they have two cloud Zs on the frame, which I will show in the lay flat mode as well. So, um, Anita Tooth, I, don't, I hope I've said that right, Anita, has said, I like that it has a nice space, bit, um, even with the carry cot on, and she would love it. Helen Marie Shields, I love it, everybody has their middle names on Facebook, it's great. <laughs> Helen Marie Shields has says she loves the leatherette handle. Um, uh, Tracy Calvin says, does it feel heavy? No, it's a well-balanced no. product, isn't it? So, exactly. yes, you've got two 22 kg children in it. It's going to be, it's going to be heavy, but it's so well-balanced. It's no heavier than anything else when you're pushing. And that's what you're doing the majority of the time, isn't it? So I think I've done three configurations now, but I, it is, it doesn't feel like you're pushing a bus, basically. With some doubles, you can feel like you're really trying to push a weight and navigate through it. I mean, obviously, we haven't got the children in it right now, but... As I say, it is a nice manoeuvrable product. It is, and we do have our weighted babies in the store. So we have our babies and we have toddlers. So yes. when people come into store, we've, we've got, got one just got there as well. No, we don't use that one. We use, we use our prettier ones. <laughs> we've got we proper our, babies. We use our prettier ones. Um, <laughs> and baby David, those people who watch us regularly know, uh, our babies have names. Yes, so, uh, mine's know. Tallulah. Ah. My baby, my Cybex baby is Tallulah. So Don't maybe mind. we need a Cybex baby yeah, in store. Maybe. Maybe we do. Maybe. I think we do. Give us a thumbs up if we need a <laughs> Cybex baby in store. Or I can send a t-shirt for yours if I can get hold of a t-shirt or a little jogging button. Ah, they're already dressed. They're oh. already dressed. They of have course they're pushchair dressed. expert uh, team mascot on one oh of them. Oh my goodness, I feel so like I need that. It was only my daughter's when I used to take her to baby shows. So it's, 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 <laughs> I've just found it in a box. So we've got twins on here. She's yes. nice and manoeuvrable. As we say, if people want to come into store and you're close by, we can put two weighted babies in here, yes. two weighted toddlers in here. People can test it on the cobbles. They test can it, test it go going up, up the curb yeah. and down the slope, push it around our furniture den as if it's a normal a day in the life, really. Yeah. Um, and we can test them in cars. And I'll just so, pop that back for the cameraman, because in case anyone's just tuned we in have again. We just had a question. I think it was Lovely. Zara Cave who joined us. And Zara actually has twins. Okay. She's been in store as well. Um, I was asking about the mattress. So 
Here we have our mattress. It's a foam mattress on the inside, but you've got your washable cover. Yes. And this bit here is super soft, yes, isn't it? Yes, it's cotton, 100% cotton. Now, we'd always recommend that people put a bottom sheet on yes. it because it's a lot easier to wash your bottom sheet. Yes. So they come in packs of two, one to wash and one yes. to wear. And we've got them in a variety of colours. Oh, so you can jazz it up. I bet you can have a bit of stripes, sparks, stripes, all sorts. Stripes, stripes and stars and stripes are the oh, most popular. Stars and stripes. Grey is also very, very popular. But yet again, can machine wash it, take everything off as well. So I'm just going to pop this up. Now, what about if we've got twins or siblings? Okay. And we need two seat units. Right. Can we pop two seat yeah, units on Yeah, sure. It? So if I take the So I'm taking over your demo. No, don't like, worry, but I, I will grab I that. I know we're in a small space, and because the gazelle has so many options, it's like, guys, what bit do we what need now? What should we have? What should <laughs> we have? So Sylvia Smith says they're really great weight limits. Um, Kajal's joined us and shared this morning. Thank you, Kajal. She said it looks great as a double. Ruth Tripp, on the other hand, is wondering if she needs another baby. <laughs> Be careful, Melissa. They're all going to blame you. I know, them. that's it. And then the dads are all going to put in a complaint to Cybex head office. Melissa did a demo. Now we have extra children. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> it's cost us a fortune. On another note, very important note, Angie Taylor Painter said, on a separate note, I love the Cybex reps dress and boots and the oh, little little kit. Thank yeah. you. Maybe I should do like a, a Holly Willoughby or like, you I know, so. thing where I got this from Primark and my shoes were from Zara. Okay. There you go. There we go. <laughs> We should enter it in the bio if it was still current. Sli sli slightly better than a pushchair expert polo shirt. Well, it's just tough to actually find what to wear because I'm not going to lie, it's relatable more to you guys, I suppose, pregnant mums, what to wear. But I've been in loungewear, living in my house with nice big jumpers on and comfy. They've let you out. And I was like, I'm allowed out. I want to feel a bit fancy, but didn't want anything gripping me too much to make me a bit body conscious. So. Thank you. <laughs> <laughs> Angie, you've just won brownie points with Melissa from Cybex. Those people who have joined us, we are giving away an amazing Cybex Gazelle S single, yes. which comes with your chassis, your lay flat from birth seat, plus your shopping basket. She grabbed it there. <laughs> um, and we'll have it all set up with what you're going to win. It's worth over £600. It's an amazing prize. All you need to do is just ask us any questions that you want this morning. If you've shared, we will love you yes. forever. And as long as you're in the UK, because we ship anywhere with the UK, we can get this out to you pretty quick. Yes, pretty they're, all, quick. they're all in stock now, which is nice. As I say, it's a new product Hooray! that's coming. So it's like, yes! So, um... Shannon um, Bryony Train says she loves the brown leatherette tan bumper bar against the black. Yes, yeah, it it's not nice. too bright tan because sometimes some people do like a tan handle, but sometimes it can be too in your a face. Bit yeah. We did have a lady who came in yesterday, and her criteria for her pram for her firstborn was just just brown leather brown leatherette or brown leather handles. Yeah, it's a big thing in it the is. UK. I mean, we do tell Germany. As UK people, love a love we a do love it. We do, we do, handle. we do. So two children, so. outgrown either twins, outgrown yep. carry cot or baby and toddler yep. outgrown. But first child is not ready to walk yet and go on um, your toddler board. Mm -hmm. What are we going to do? So we have um, the seat unit that comes in the box, and we have the seat unit that you can buy um, separately. Now visually, these look the same. They're just slightest bit of difference. So they both take 22 kg. Should we just kg. Do spot the difference? Yeah. Can anybody I mean, spot the I've, difference? It's, yeah. So what it is, is I think if I recall, there's a slightest bit more upright on one of them because of the configuration of when they're laying down in the actual ah. pram. But visually, they look identical apart from here as well. Um, your second seat unit that will only fit on the top of the chassis has that little line on it as well. So, so nice seats, you know, pretty, pretty similar. You don't have to choose your favourite yeah. child. Yeah, and as I say, 22 kg. So it's like with some of the brands, it's a case of you may have different seat options of shapes and things like this, but these are literally identical. It's no, you know, no messing now, around with it. I have to say, I'm, I'm going to put my hand on my heart. We've been a long time waiting for a tandem pushchair from Cybex. You know, long you've... time waiting? Yes. I've been in this company for three years now, and oh my goodness, since day one coming out of retail, I've been asking. 
I've been asking. Yeah. But it's worth the wait at the same well, time. Well, we're, we're glad it's worth the wait, but we, we have been waiting yeah. a long time. So it's a jolly good job it's worth the I wait. Know, I know, I you know. <laughs> we've been waiting. You're telling me, guys, I've been asking. It was the product that you were really missing. Yes, yes. But you're not anymore. No, it's here. It's fab and we love it. So, so. we've filled the gap. Yes. So this is the Gazelle S. Great push chair for one child. Great push chair for siblings, baby. Yes. And another one. Great push chair for twins as well. Yes. I mean, what I love, and I'm going to show one of my favourite configurations. It does depend on the children. I'm going to say that because it depends whether anyone's a bit more fidgety than the other. But unlike other brands, you can actually have the children facing each other on the seat unit. So... I pop that one on the bottom and I pop so like I said your second seat unit has to fit in the top your seat unit that comes with the pram originally can come at the top or the bottom because you can put your shopping basket at the top so that's important but if I just wriggle this bumper bar a second so that I can put maybe this foot bit down a little bit but as I say, you can have your two children facing each other, which yeah, is really that's nice. that's great. They can just keep themselves yeah. occupied there. They can yeah, exactly. faces at each yeah. other and you, just, you can just walk and relax. Exactly. As I say, you just probably wouldn't put the fidgety one on the top. The fidget bum will go on the bottom. Yeah, put fidget yeah. bum on the bottom. <laughs> but, you know, it is nice. And again, for twins, they do it's like just that to bonding. see each other. But then there are times when really they don't want to be seen no, looking at each other. No. They really don't want to because they're just arguing. Uh, <laughs> we have a solution. That's like me and my brother. We are 13 months apart and <gasps> I don't know how my mum did it because we are bicker, bicker. We're, we're still bicker now. <laughs> and, you know, I don't know how she did it because she wouldn't have something this great. I don't think back when, when I was born. But there you so go. So we're getting lots of comments about them facing each other. Um, Lots of people loving it. I just think it's really nice to have that option. Yes. And it is about having options. You know, face to face might not work all the time if they're a bit no. grumpy with each other. No. But then there are other times when it might really work. Oh and yeah, just occupy. Exactly. Children, children just, you know, some days they're friends, some days they're not. It's just <laughs> life. Oh yeah, exactly, exactly. Um, so with this as well, we could have one facing outwards which will also lead on to me showing you guys that it can actually fold with both seat units see, on as well. This is a really nice USP, a very good, unique selling point here with this. I believe there's a second way of doing it, but at this moment in time, I can't recall it off the top of my head. <laughs> the pressure, the pressure. I think, well, I think it's a German way of doing it, um, but I can't recall it right now. So I'm going to show you the way that I know to fold it. So, like we said before, with any of our seat units to fold them, it's the recline clip. Crip. I can't get my words out there. Oh, testing, testing, one, two, one, two. The <laughs> recline clip. If you pop that over, and then that can be at a slight angle there. So we're lining that front seat yes. up with the chassis. So as long as we line it up, yep. it's going to work, isn't yes. it? Yes. And although people think, oh, I've got to remember to line it up. Once you're doing it, day in, day out, you just do yeah. it. Yeah, so like we said before, anyone that's just tuned in, to fold this product, you slide a bit with your thumb grip here, but it still doesn't let you do it because we've got a second, well, a third safety catch. So you push that bit there, give it a slight tap, and then it can be one whole piece like that. So it can freestand in a hallway, and if you wanted to then take your bumper bar off to, you know, pop it in the car and things, you can. And if you want to pop that section down, you can. So you can see how small that is, to That's be fair. That's amazing. For a double. That is amazing. And it's nice. The other thing that people don't think about, if you go into a restaurant, because we can now, yes. um, and you take your children out, pop them in their high chairs or what have you, and then restaurants will often allow you to fold your pushchair yeah. and leave it somewhere. There is nothing worse yeah. than having to have a seat on the floor that just gets oh. dirty. You've got everything there nice yeah. and clean because nothing touches the floor well that's what i was about to say that is a design thing that we've done as well to make sure nothing gets scraped on the floor your handle can be up nice and high your fabrics can be up nice and high so yeah great and you know what you've just reminded me we can finally stop sitting outdoors today <laughs> today is a good yeah, day you, you know what's going to happen now don't you the sun's going to start shining so we <laughs> want to be outdoors no, exactly no you know you know holly has said that's so convenient for small cars yes um ruth trip says fantastic it can fold all together it yep. saves losing bits and it's still not shannon too heavy. shannon briny train says and you can fold it with both seats what i know I who knew? <laughs> Who knew? Who knew? 
Um, but it is an amazing feature. There are quite a lot of features that we love on the Gazelle, yes. and this is certainly one of them. And then we can just lift it back out and then just put your handlebar all the way up. And then if I, oh, I've not moved my seat. One second. There we go. And we can get them back up again. So it is nice and fluid as yes. well, isn't it? We'll just pop our seat uh, back. Yeah, I just want that kid to fall out, yeah, not. Don't, yeah, don't, don't fall with <laughs> your children in. Um, Lisa go. Beaver has shared this morning. Thank you very much, Lisa, for sharing. We really, really do appreciate it. Jess Howard says, that looks amazing for twins. Joe Johnson, superb push show in all aspects. I'm going to flip that around from Joe's comment. Is there anything you don't like about this? You know, uh, let's be honest here. Is there anything that anybody is unsure about or says, can it do X, Y, Z? So we've talked about the fact we can yep. have it as a single with your extra basket. Yep. We can have it uh, for siblings. So yes. we can have a seat and a carry cot. We can have, we can have it for twins. So we can have two carry cots on. We can have it for two toddlers. Yes. Um, we can always, we can add the buggy board as well. So yep. if you've got three children, yep. this could work for you. Yep. Can we put the buggy board on with two carry cots? Um, I would have to double check on that one. I should imagine so, but I'm not 100% sure. So the we, head, will so we will that check that one out. That. We will That's check that question. one out That's a good question. There you go. Yeah, we like our good questions. I know. I'm like, hmm. I will double check. Ah, Coral Valentine Newton has summed it up. She says it's the transformer of pushchairs. Oh, it is. Any of our car seats as well, people do say some of them are transformers because they extend, they pop down, they, they do. sort of alternate. Now, can I give you a challenge? Oh, God. Um, depends what it is guys okay i've got i've got a challenge for you melissa oh. how quickly oh gosh can you, you fold the push chair with two seat units on what from scratch because i've not even got it in the configuration you can put yet. it in the configuration okay, that you would like to have it in <laughs> guys no I'm, I'm nervous okay because we do talk about having push chair expert olympics i'm just going to move yeah, it back a bit there you go. and how quickly can you oh, hang on fold it Put your hands in the air in the middle and then <laughs> unfold it. Go. Go. She's good. She's good at this. Oh my God, the pressure, the pressure, the pressure. <laughs> the pressure's getting to me. <laughs> I didn't even leave the seat no. all the way up. Oh. Should we start again? Let's start again. <laughs> I'm not good under again, pressure. Guys. <laughs> guys, I've only had one cup of tea today. Don't judge. <laughs> <laughs> now, this was a little bit mean because I didn't tell her this. No, Those it was of you kinda... who join us regularly, we keep saying that we're going to have like brand Olympics and get people in. What? We're going to do and races. And I didn't even wear my sports gear. I know. We're going to do races and all kinds of things. So you can set this up however you like to right. start folding it. So then I might have to. Yeah, I got too excited and started folding the other seat when I didn't need to fold it. So I actually gave myself extra work. I know. I don't know what you're doing there. What's going on? Right. right. Are you ready? Are you ready? You can right. do this. Let's go. Go. There you go. Hands in the air. Unfold. Go, 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 go. Okay. Oh, it's easy to unfold. Look at that. Yes. Well done. Drop the mic. Everybody give her a thumbs up. <laughs> that was impressive because I didn't tell you I was going to do that. No, I? that was pressure. You know why I didn't tell you? Because I didn't know. <laughs> We're just going with it. So what I would, yeah, Zoe Willis, fold away challenge. Eliza McCarby was like, three, two, one, go. <laughs> three, two, one, go. Um, Emma Louise Riley, quick fold is perfect in a rush. You might have a little bit more time if you do oh, it in normal life. Yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> I do don't know. When I have to um, pop out and I take my samples with me, say I came in here and it could happen today, British weather, I could walk outside and I could go and put my sample in the car and it's throwing it down. So I'm kind of that three, two, one. So but... she's <laughs> off. She's off. Kajal says, very quick. Yes. Marissa says, hmm, about four seconds. <laughs> about four seconds. There you go. I can add that as like one of my things now. It, I can go home to my partner and go, I can fold a pram in four seconds. What can you do? I can fold a, I can fold a pram for two children in yeah, four seconds. Yeah, yeah. He'll go, he'll go. Song. It'll take me four seconds to think about it. <laughs> Thanks, ma'am. What can you say? Exactly. Can you say? <laughs> so Marta says, folding with both seats. Very, very impressive. Alina Zabertsky says, very handy when you've got a crazy toddler. <laughs> yes, it is. Um, Zara K says freestanding is handy too. I need this push chair. Margaret Carr says, well done, Melissa. Oh, thank um, you. And Marissa, Melissa, Marissa. I know, Melissa. Marissa, Marissa. says, be like Supermum in the supermarket. Oh. Um, Gemma Lindley, exactly what you said. Perfect for trying to get the car quickly, uh, into the car quickly when it is raining. Ria Leanne says, this push chair is amazing. Yeah, it really is. Really, really clever thing. Thing? Push thing, chair? Thing, thing. Yeah, thing. thing. 
product? Product? I don't know. I don't want to call it whatever. <laughs> we're live and, um, you know, who knows? So we've got Melissa here. Remember your name? Remember your name? Now, which brand are you from? Oh, yes, Cybex. Oh, yeah, yep. Cybex. Mar- Melissa. <laughs> it's because we've been reading out Marissa. We might just have to start saying Mel now just so we don't get confused. No, that will confuse me. So we have got Melissa from Cybex who's travelled over to Push Chair Expert today. We are taking a very close look at the amazing yes. transformation Formable, is that a word? Yeah, yeah, we we'll just go S. with it. <laughs> um, today, and we are giving away a single Gazelle S in black with top frame. Yes, which and we will show it's you. It's worth over six hundred pounds. All you need to do is join in with our chat today, and we will draw the winner yeah. very, very just shortly. Just give a hello. But Any before questions? we go, we missed out the two car seats, didn't yes. we? Yes. So I've got another color of a cloud z but i've got the two set of adapters on the frame already like i said you do buy those separately if i pop it on and say this is ideal for the twin mums so and you can have matching car seats or not matching yeah we just we just pulled two out of the store <laughs> yeah we i i was gonna bring mine with me but i was like oh they'll have two yeah we've got we've i think we've got three out actually so and that is with your handles out the way so like i said lay flat outside the vehicle no time limit on them so ideal um just in general as i say but for twins really recommended as well. lots of our twin mums do love the cloud z we had a question earlier saying yep. will the cloud z go on any other brands of push chair yes it goes on a whole host of push chairs we just need to make sure it's being tip tested on that chassis yes. for you so we always make sure we're putting the safety of your little one first but it is a very very popular car seat for twin parents well all parents but twin yeah. parents because you've got that ability to oh. recline it i mean it's just one of those things isn't it i've seen it quite often you will have as well joe when you've got uh, twins it's a case of one's deciding they want the nappy change at a different time to the other you're trying to juggle everything sometimes if they're both asleep it's the most magical moment so if they're asleep on this product what, at the same time yeah i mean it could happen it could apparently occasionally occasionally so you could then pop them in well you've done a long drive pop them on here lay it flat time limit gone and just one last thing to show as well is if i can get it off from today there we go it's because i'm quite short for a moment you're then i've struggled have, you're gonna have to just grow aren't you <laughs> um so we also as i said it's the um lay flat car seat that goes up to 24 months tallest on the market it also fits onto the first spinning base so if i can see what i'm doing past my long hair today because unfortunately i've still not gone to the hairdressers yet no i haven't either <laughs> you can click it onto the base and then what i say is slide the green grip the gray and if i can do it from this angle let me come actually round to the cameraman is you can i can get enough grip there you go spin it so you can access the child from the car door and also it goes a little bit further than for your three door car access as well and then you can turn them round and click them in and, and then it's it, very clever because you can't accidentally forward face oh no. the seat on it can you no you can't forward face it and then also there is then a second seat option that will also fit onto this ice fix base which is called the serona zi size that will then go up to your four years and that can rearward face up to four or if the customer wants to eventually forward face them they can after the 15 months and the and height it's restriction still going to spin yeah but it's, it's a great product. Oh, Holly Jane has said, my toddler just told me we should get this push chair. That's all the permission I need. Well, Holly, <laughs> just send us a message. We can sort that out for you. No problem. Um, the Cloud Z's just such a popular seat, oh. isn't it? It really, really is. Yeah. And, you know, that was a game changer yes. in the market. You've now plugged your hole. Yep. Cybex hole, sorry Cybex, but I'm going to be honest, you were missing <laughs> yeah, we a were missing a You were missing yeah, a tandem 100%. pusher, and yep. now it's here. So yep. can we set this back up as a single yep, with To show the guys price? what they could win. You could win this today. Unfortunately, you can't win me, oh. um, but you never know. Oh, I'm sure it could be arranged. Anyone watching from Cybex, just send me a quick message. <laughs> can, can this be arranged? <laughs> Come round for a cup of tea and a chat. What? <laughs> you can go in the house now. I know. 
So we're going to turn it, as we said at the beginning, you get all so your adapters included. Only additional extra you might need is your car seat adapters, but everything else is included. Now this is, does come out of the box and it is suitable from birth. So you yes. get your light, the seat will lay flat yep. um, in a different configuration. Yep, which I can show. Which we'll show in a moment, but you also get your shopping basket. Yes, 10 kg shopping basket and then you've also got 13 in the bottom. Give us a thumbs up if you love the fact we've got two shopping baskets. I love it. The men are going to be going no. <laughs> the <laughs> women are going to be going yes. yes. Definitely. I mean... <laughs> You need a big shopping basket. I mean, I have one of the Cybex changing bags as my actual work bag. And oh my God, it's so big. And if it had actually it big, loads of it? nappies in it and everything else going on, where am I going to fit it? Because I'm not going to break my shoulder off. <laughs> so I could actually just store it in there. And we've got a humongous basket. So we are giving away an amazing Cybex Gazelle S this morning. Just All those things. people who have commented, thank you very much. You're already entered into the draw. We're going to be drawing our winner live. Melissa is going to be helping us choose our winner. No so if pressure. you don't win, it's all her fault, not mine. <gasps> so you can complain to her. No. <laughs> um, so there's lots and lots of options here. You can add on your carry cot, second seat. You can add on toddler board. Oh. We've got foot muffs. We've got changing bags. And I'll just show that you as well. You name oh, it. We've got we loads of adapters All in there. the answers, don't we? Yes. yes. And it's for anyone watching as well, we said about the Cloud Z. We've also got the Aton MI size, which is done with bundles as yep. well with you guys. So it's whether you want the lay flat option and the spinning option, or if you're happy to not have that option. Your more traditional seat, yeah. but it's still a very good seat, isn't it? Well, that goes to 24 months as well. Um, and as I say, it's eye size tested. So they're both great products. It just depends what you're after. Different people want different things, different lifestyles, yep. different budgets, all kinds of things. But we've got the whole of the Cybex range. So we can always do a bundle that is going to suit oh. you. So if you see a bundle and you think, well, I want all of that, but I don't need um, the changing bag. I've already yep. got my changing bag. Or you see a bundle and go, yeah, but I want a cup holder. I want a boogie board. I want um, uh, yeah. a toddler board. Muff, I want a yeah. foot muff. All these Parasol. different things. Parasol. Yeah, I nearly forgot. Gloves. Yeah. Gloves, gloves, yeah, gloves. Yeah. you can add those in as well. Very, very important for those people expecting yeah. their winter bed. We should have the gloves in here. Yeah, I mean, the only thing you can't do on this one compared to others, which you might have seen Joe do. Oh, is, I guess on the preamp. Yeah, is on our preamp, you can put skis on it. Yeah. But on this one, as I say, yes. that's the only Why feature can't you can't do. Skis on this one? I don't, oh, know. I don't know. Maybe it's asking too much, and maybe we're actually thinking if you go downhill on a slope <laughs> in the snow with two children, it might be a weight issue. Goodbye. <laughs> yeah. Bye. So, to be fair, there's not many push It'll be like a toboggan ride. For. Not many. Um, Holly says, is the rain cover included? Yes, it yes. is. Your foot muff is an extra unless we've put it together for a yep. bundle. Um, everybody loves a bundle, so we can put any bundle. Oh. We always say there's only so many bundles we can list for Cybex or yep. any, any brand online because... They, oh, there's just so much. There's just so, so many. It could become very, very confusing. Yeah. But we are happy to put together any yeah. bespoke bundles for people. We can well, we just do all sorts. Some they... people want a, um, a, a carry cup holder. Cot. Some, people... Some people don't. Some people want a carry cot. Some people don't. So we can yeah. do it. It's a little bit like going to a restaurant. We can either go a la carte or we can go set menu. But that's just where it's good with our brand, as I say. It's not one shoe fits all kind of thing. It's what kind of parent are you? I know it's sometimes hard for the first time parent to understand and decide that, but what kind of fits your living lifestyle of, have you got to walk up to a flat? Have you got a small yeah. car boot? Have you got a dog? Are you going to go walk in? I've got a dog. You've got a dog. dog. I know, but I'm still sad. That it, at the start of this video, it wasn't like an Andrex advert where I had this I little know, dog running at I, me with some, you know, toilet roll. I did roll. try and persuade William to bring, to bring her in, but she's just, uh, you little yeah. puddles on the floor. I know what would happen though as well, like the toilet roll would get wrapped around me, I would probably hit the stage lights, it wouldn't be that cute, come here little fluffy oh, dog. Oh, she's, she's very good actually, <laughs> it'd be, she's very good. It'd be me falling over she trying to play. She'd asleep in the corner this morning. <laughs> anyway, we digress. Um, Lindsay Hibbard, thank you very much for sharing today. She says she needs this Cybex in, in her life, this is the Cybex Gazelle S and this is our prize today in the lovely taupe and black with yeah. our chocolate leatherette handle. Aww. We love, I love the chocolate I leatherette do. handle. And, and a basket. Yeah, I just love the basket and because basket. at I the minute- I just take it on my own. Yeah, but these days as well, there's nothing worse than when you go to the supermarket at the moment you see the baskets and you go, 
let me grab my spray, let me spray the handle, let me walk in. Where's this? I could just walk in out the car and just have my own shopping basket. There we go. I know it's I know it's fine, it's me using it. There you go. So do you think we should get, draw our winner? Anybody want to win? Do we need to drum roll? Yeah, no, I think we definitely. <laughs> Give us a thumbs up if you want to win. Give us a heart if you really want to win. Give us both if you really, really want to win. <laughs> See what I'm doing There you go, exactly. See Give us all the love. It. So, um, just in case you don't know how we draw I, our I'm winners. I'm not sure. Go for you it. You don't I'll know, make... okay, because the pressure is on. Okay. The pressure oh, is on. Oh, God. Look at these hearts. Look, look at these hearts. There are people who okay. really, really, really want to win. <laughs> Um, all you need to be is in the UK and um, I've given us a comment um, this morning or this afternoon because I think we're definitely afternoon now to win our amazing Cybex Gazelle yes. S worth well over £600. It is an amazing price and if you don't want the price just give it back to me because we really <laughs> like it, okay? So Melissa is going to draw our winner. The way that we do okay. our winners is literally, it's very, very random, <gasps> oh. okay? Because I'm going to scroll up and down. I'm yep. going to go up to the top and down to the bottom. I kind of just scroll. Just scroll. Sometimes okay. up and up and up and up and up and then okay. down and down and down and down and down. So everyone's putting like 20 comments right and now. And then, yeah, they're all putting their comments. <laughs> they really want to win. Marta says she really wants to win. Lauren is going, eek. <laughs> <laughs> Katie Bostock, an amazing prize. My foster babies would love it. Oh. Coral Valentine Newton, who was one of our winners last week, said good luck, everybody. Oh, well, yeah, I was going to say, got to give it Come someone on, else this time. <laughs> Come on, guys. Um... So, uh, Zoe Willis can't stop looking at the, staring at the frame. This is our taupe frame. She loves it. So, I think we better draw our yeah, winner. Let's go, go, for go it, guys. Go for right. It. I'm going to start scrolling. Give it a bit of time so we go up and down. Right. I'm going to do drum roll. Can well, do if I do my thighs, it might be louder at the minute. A bit of uh, lockdown thighs. <laughs> so, I'm just going up and down randomly. So, whenever you're ready, Melissa. <laughs> go. No, you're supposed to have to stop. Oh, not okay. Go. We, oh, right, let's, let's try go. again. Stop. <laughs> Duh, stop. So our winner today oh. is Amy Calderbank. So Amy, I'm just going to reply congratulations. Amy Calderbank, I'm just writing congratulations, otherwise I'll miss your comment. You are oh, our there winner. You go. So please, Amy. Just send us a message and we will get this all sorted for you. So, everybody, thank you for joining yes, us. Thank Marissa, you. Thank you for coming. Oh, you know Cybex. what? I've loved it. And if everyone wants to comment that I should come more often, then I might be able to say who to my wants, bosses, who I come wants every week. To see <laughs> Melissa more often. What should oh. we show next time? Um, we've got, well, I know, guys, have a little think about what you would like to have shown and we can always put it together but we've got compact strollers we've got an electric pram oh, we've got yeah, I our think... car seats for high back boosters for bigger children let's go out on location with the e-pram oh. somewhere hot and warm see what i'm doing here oh, yeah, where we yeah, can go yeah. on the beach yeah, okay yeah yeah, yeah. yeah yeah over some cobbles perhaps an ancient so we're city. thinking skegness <laughs> no, no, we weren't thinking segment. We were thinking, how do we get it on a plane? Oh, 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 see what I'm well, doing yeah, here? Yeah, I see what you're doing. We'll have to see uh, what COVID restrictions are yeah, going on. No, I think, I think that's a great, great plan there. But perhaps you can come back and we can have a look. Maybe yes. we should have a look at some of the strollers yeah. or uh, the pream. Yes. Because everybody loves the pream. We've got a bit of everything. Or so. the Barrios. We, we've got loads, haven't we? We've got yeah, loads. We could do a compare and contrast yeah. with the Balios. I mean, we? guys, see what you're after as well, because obviously we love the Balios, we love the Priam. They're great strollers as well. But it might be that there's a few of you live today that are thinking of going on some trips when we can finally go. We've got a couple of the compact, but also travel systems at the same time. So, yeah, we could, we we can could do to a everyone. mixture. But thank you so much thank for, you for making having me. the trek over here. We've thank got Richard in store today, yes, haven't we? Yes going through lots of products with the staff and anybody who's popping in stores. We're having a real Cybex day yes, today. Cybex day. So make sure you pop in if you are local. We have opened our doors. We're appointment only Saturdays and Sundays. But in the week we are appointment if you want to guarantee that one-to-one -one with one of our nursery specialists. Yep. Or we have opened our doors. So we will be operating what we call wait list. So if the store is too full, although we have a massive store, we yep. can just let you sit in the comfort of your car and we can, you can take a coffee out with you and a biscuit um, and then oh. we'll just send you a text as soon as you can come in. Oh, so we've got it all that. planned. I know. It's, it's so sorted. basically I'm just going to go sit in my car in a minute, guys, have um, a cup of tea and just, you know. Just you're just going to go to our yeah. coffee machine, aren't yeah, you? Yeah. Yep. 
Yeah, maybe. Or if it's really hot, you could have Might. some cold water. <laughs> but thank you very much, everybody, for thank joining you. us. It's been such a pleasure. Make thank sure you, you join us. We go live most days round about 11.30 in the morning. So set a reminder on Alexa. Alexa, set a reminder for 11.30 to watch Pushchair Expert. You can see what I did there. <laughs> yeah. 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 See what I did. <laughs> um, but we will see you tomorrow. So take care, everybody. Thank and you, thanks, guys. Melissa. Thank Cheers. you. Bye-bye.